four three two one five four three two one ba ba five four three two one hey hey no <laughs> hello and welcome to another episode of Game Hammer Live. Oh my goodness, we are back again. As you can hear from my voice, I'm not a hundred percent, but I am much much better than I was yesterday, where we had to call the show early. So we're gonna be playing a game. I believe it's the last in a series because it says Final Fantasy. <laughs> oh, that joke will never get good, will it? <laughs> so, yes, we are doing Final Fantasy. Final Fantasy. It's the final one and it's fantastic, isn't it? Yes. Oops. I just dropped the game. Okay. That's not a good sign. So. Yeah, I am still not 100%, let me put it that way, and I've opened it to the wrong one, because that says disc 1 and 3. We need disc 2. So, it's going to be one of those nights. I'm trying my absolute best to stay together. This is disc 2 or 3, that's the one that we need. So, let's see who's in the chat while I get this set up. Hello to Martin Vegas, or St. Martin Vegas of Tours, the first, yes. The first tour. <laughs> hello, Martin. Hello to Dave Holloway, who says, Evening, peeps. Yes, hello to you too, Dave. And we have a message from Iron Horse Railways, who says, I'm not late! <laughs> In capital letters. I mean, good evening. Yes, uh, we've got to remember that no one is ever late here on Game Hammer, because we are all stuck in the past. That's how it works. So... I've got the game booting up in the background, so I can now close down this window that I've got here, and we'll see whether we can actually see the game. Aha! Here it is! I've just realised I haven't got the memory card in. It's probably not the best, because the save's on here, but this isn't attached to a to a computer, so let me just uh, do a quick switcheroo. And plug it in. Can you tell that I'm not 100% not really with it yet? Because uh, I can. I can tell that very, very well. <laughs> the game I've just taken out before I was putting this in is uh, missing. There it is. Grand Theft Auto 3, because from, that was from last night. I just closed everything down and went to bed. So I ended up watching an episode of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles from back in the day. And that was a lot of fun, I have to admit. That was a lot of fun. The old titles. <laughs> Say your prayers, titles. So, yes. So, uh, I was watching that and uh, quite a nostalgia. Let's put it that way. It was a lot of fun. It was actually, the first episode is a lot better than you'd think, given uh, the age of it and what it was designed for, which is just to sell toys. But, you know, these things sometimes come out as classics. So, I'm just going to grab my controller of Sonic. Sonic the Hedgehog. Or Sonic the Hedge, as I once drew. Just as a sketch of a hedge with uh, running shoes on the bottom. <laughs> a speech bubble saying, gotta grow fast. I am that kind of artist, what can I say? So, we're going to load up. Uh, Iron Horse says, now we need to attack Midgar, escape the sewers, and continue on our way. A guide may help. It's been 15 years since I was here last. I love that about gaming. It's like, it does feel like we were there, doesn't it? So we're going in. Bum face to the rescue. And, uh, set that. Whoa, that's loud. That is loud. Okay, so... Here we go. We're inside. We're in here. We did something. We we did a run, didn't we? Yes. So we're going this way now, I believe. Because we picked up the weird stuff. What music? Wow, that is great. I love that. That is fantastic. Straight into the action. Let's go. We're going this way. We need to attack Midgar. The, the, the whole of it. It's a it's a big place. I was there, man. You weren't. You didn't see what I saw, man. The smells, man. The smell. If you could see the smells, that was a bad smell. <laughs> oh, hang on. We've still got Grand Theft Auto as the, uh, as the today's game, haven't we? So. 
final fantasy 7 on play station station I loved Bill and Ted back in the day. It was great. Right, we need to re remove the numpties because we don't have any numpties. La last night I drove into the river a few times. That's uh, That was quite the numpty. But here we go. Beep, beep. Ooh. Who's fighting us in the way? Arr, Jim lad. Arr. <laughs> oh, it's a robotic penguin on a wheel. And... The clangers? Blue clangers? Weird, okay. Strange situation, but I'll I'll take it. Bumface is gonna do a, an Omni Slash. Have we seen Omni Slash yet? I don't think we've seen Omni Slash. Ooh. Here we go. Omni Slash. <laughs> thunder, thunder, thunder. Thundercats. Oh, <laughs> that's what that looks. What the? <laughs> oh my goodness! Look at the shocked nature of that. Uh, oh, it's not shocked. <laughs> that was that was the um, that was the rockets on his back, but it looked like eyes going. <gasps> Holy crap! That's overpowered. <laughs> okay, I love this game. We had some problems with this game, didn't we? We had a few. Uh, knocks with it but i'm back to it now oh yes turbo ether when you need some more ether Ooh. that doesn't look good all right let's go this way welcome to omnis <laughs> that's the most overpowered thing i've seen in a long time oh dear so we've got water coming in we had electric uh, sn uh, sparking behind if the water and the electric get together, we're screwed. Because that's that's the nature of things being screwed. <laughs> oh man. I'll tell you what, I've been I've spent the last four hours doing uh, video stuff for RuneScape, because I'm doing a review on that. The first two hours it didn't record. <laughs> so I had to do it again, and it's just ridiculous. But this is made up for it. RuneScape is an interesting game, by the way. I'm not entirely sure whether I can recommend it. I enjoy it. I've been playing a lot of it. Mostly because I had to do this review. But, um, hmm. Would I recommend it? It's got an awful lot of uh, issues. But uh, I enjoyed it enough that I've signed up for a month's membership on it. So, to get into the extra areas and see more requests. But even then, I'm not entirely sure that I would recommend it. It's just that I like massively multiplayer on my role-playing games, so it's a bit weird, isn't it? There's water on the floor now. We are definitely in an area that is going to be a health and safety violation in the making. The term works on both levels, works on multiple levels when returned to rivers and people being in, being rivers and in rivers. People being rivers? Why is she kicking everyone? Did he... I don't know why she's uh, doing her celebration dance there. <laughs> she can, all she did was slap one of our other people. My goodness. Also, we're rich by this point. We've got an awful lot of uh, guild. So let's get in there. Oh man, I'm enjoying this again so much. A change, a break is as good as a change. Change is as good as the rest and all that. Uh, a couple of weeks off and we're into it again. Let's do this, let's do this. Let's kick some butts. How far is this freaking exit? This is ridiculous. I need to get... We should have brought a bike. Imagine this. Imagine this in the remake. You're zooming along to the to the finale on, like, little bikes or something. That would be much better. We need to beef cloud up. His Omni Slash should be doing at least 7,000 per hit. You're freaking kidding me, right? The exit is far. <laughs> Look at... It's getting even worse now. The way that we're going, we might actually be beefed up by the time we get to where we're going. This seems like... This is like the opening to Final Fantasy XIII. Where it's just a 15-hour run down the corridor. 
Everyone's got Bolt 3 now. This is brilliant. <laughs> I love it. Here we go. Let's kick some butts. Find some butts and kick them and we've leveled up in all. Excellent. Find some butts and kick them and then find some more butts and kick them too. XP for great justice. Oh yes. Ooh. Is this the way out? We're gonna have a look up here. Cloud is fully legitimately capable of doing 9,999 damage per single hit before being level eight. Is this the route? Is this the way we came in? This is, oh my goodness. We've just got back to where we came in after picking up all that stuff. Good grief. The exit really is a long way away. <laughs> oh my goodness, guys. Yes, we were going the wrong way. Oh, wonderful. That's just fantastic. We'll see how we go. Who are we here fighting now? Is it another penguin? A back attack. They're attacking our back. But it doesn't matter because we're going to fight them for everyone. Holy crap! They're electric plants. There we go. Back down and up, says Iron Horse. We were going the wrong way. I'm going to see what's through here. We'll see what happens. Level up. Excellent. I should get one of those buttons that just goes -ling -ling, and when I press it for a level up, that would be cool. I don't, I don't know if we can get one of those, but I will look into it because I like a level up. Who's this penguin? Hello! Oh, it's Melody. Okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! I thought we were. Is she telling us we should go right? Okay, let's do this. She's on the right hand side, so I'm assuming we go that way. Please tell me we've gone the right way. <laughs> if I get to the end and have to turn back, I'll be very, very... Uh, but, uh, it seems fitting. Lose the stream for a bit there. Nothing's cut out here from what I can tell. Do this. Kick the butts! We've got electric plants here. They're not plants, are they? They're gun turrets. They look like plants. They look like some of the plants from Plants vs. Zombies. Are they actually hurting us at all? <coughs> Let's get in now. Kick him. Yes! 5,000 damage. Right, before we go any further, I am going to check that we're going the right way. Right. We'll leave it on the level up screen for a moment. We're going to have a look now and see what happens. Hang on, Turbo Ether. The stream keeps buffering. Okay, I'll, ch I'll have a look into that as well. Right, we're on the menu screen. Another quick check. Where's my phone? There it is. Alright, let's have a... That's not my phone. I know I've got a phone because I was using it. I probably left it in the bedroom when I was uh, in there earlier. Oh well, never mind. Oh, what was that? Oh, I heard it. Wow, that was quite a nasty crack there. Okay, let's quickly check on YouTube. Make sure that I'm a, I'm actually on the stream, you know. And I'm the only person watching. I feel bad, Zoe. Everyone always tunes in for your other shows. Not this one. To be honest with you, I don't mind. It's fine. So, this now you get to see what I watch. Stream is fine for me, says Dave. Thank you. At least we know. So, now you get to see what I watch because of YouTube. I watch uh, Iron Horse. <laughs> Josh Strife Hayes, who's great and talks a lot about uh, various uh, things. The Click, of course. 
So, a stream's fine for you. Okay, that's great. So, uh, Final Fantasy VII Re-Enter Midgard. Midgar. Oh, it's called Midgar, not Midgard. We're visiting to. Let's see what we got. Final Fantasy VII thing. Get out the way! Uh, horrible thing about cookies. Right, we're in there. That's where we go in. Someone has been playing this on a very high quality thing. I think that's a PS3 with a playing a PS1 game because it's uh, upgraded, upscaled graphics. Or it's a PC. Could be on the PC. Right. My uh, thing is currently uh, scrolling like mad because... Uh, right, there we are. We go in. Got the armlets and all that. We know where all of this is. Going through all these. Into the tunnels. Blah, blah, blah. There's the fight with the people that we did last time. There's the W item that we got, and there's the thingamajig, the, the save. So, we go back up. Okay. Travel all the way back to where you fought the Turks by going north. You were near. Take the right pathway at each split. The area 1, 2, 3, etc. Until you reach area 8. Numbers identify which area are located on the back wall in red. Right. Are they? Okay. In area 8, you have the option from to the left. This direction leads you to the next section of Midgar and continues the game. Or to the right, this direction leads you to area 0. Take a left in the next section and climb the ladder to find yourself back at the Shinra building. Shinra building has some optional items. So we actually managed to screw up into the correct direction to get extra bits? That sounds pretty cool. Okay, let's do this. Where? We're in area 16? Area 8. So this is area 8. Right, this is the one. Right, area 8. You have the option of going to the left or the right. Right, take a left in the next section. Oh, right, okay, I get what's going on. So we go through here. Fight whoever comes in. And see what happens. Right, let's do this. Oh, look, it's the, the weird things again. So, double cut on that one, and then just magic fireball the rest. I am recording something. Yes, I am. Hey! <coughs> so, if we go left on the next bit, we should get to where we're supposed to be going to get the extras. So, we managed to just accidentally go the correct direction to, <laughs> to pick up extra stuff, which I like. That's very appropriate. Is that a... Is that a ladder? No, it's background scenery. Okay, so it must be the next optional bit where we can leave, yeah? They probably hid it down a further panel. Yep, here we are. Right. Who's this? Hello! Were you expecting us? Whoever you are? Oh, it's, we're fighting a penguin again. Okay, magic. But straight away you just get straight in there. That's ridiculous. He's still alive? Gordon's alive. Did he... He's gone. So, we have a guy who just used his own gun arm to shoot himself in the face, but somehow didn't die from it. That's, that's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness, I'm full of gunk. <laughs> Tell you what, flying on ever airplanes. And... <coughs> it's not great. <clears throat> you pay a lot of money to sit in a box of other people's farts, basically. Hello, who's this? Bird's eye says. Which way? Gosh darn piece of beep cabin. Okay. Well, we're going this way. I can't even read what that says there. So we go left this time. There it is! Oh, 
get up. Cool, thank you. Right, we're going to the Shinra building. We're going to find some stuffs. That is stuffs spelled S-T-U with an umlaut over it. F-F-Z. <laughs> stuffs. <laughs> the Spanish Chin Quiz Physician. The ideal specialist interest member for the pub quiz. Okay. Ooh. Right, here's a save, so we're going to save. No, no! The sister Ray is not this way. Oh, no, Conti had the, the weird voice. No, no, the sister Ray is not this way. Though apparently in the new version he's Scottish, which I thought was hilarious, because, like, <laughs> he's about as Scottish as I am. All right, here we go. Let's, uh... <coughs> Use some magic to heal up Tosspot, since I've just realised he's almost dead. There we go. And save the game. Save that game. Kick in the buttocks that save the game. I don't know what I'm singing now. Hello, Captain Dowd. Will you be speaking with an Italian accent and doing that weird backwards hand wave thing that kids do? Um, I didn't... I. A weird backwards hand wave? Is that what it is? I, I don't know what that is. Uh, I can't do an Italian accent. I am not good at accents. You may have noticed. Because the, the problem with an Italian accent is that I don't notice it. Even when I was in Italy, people just spoke with like uh, an American accent when they were speaking English. It was weird. A bit obnoxious as well to, at times. Like, we invented it. <laughs> Give us our accent, damn it. We earned it! Ah, Shinra doesn't like us but wandering around their property apparently. So let's kill all of them since they shot at us. So it's only natural and right and good and proper that we attack them with lightning. But hello Captain Dowd, welcome to the show. Good to see you here. And there we go. <coughs> Did I do it? Hooray! So we just used tents at save. Yeah. Probably a good idea. Right. I watched Charles yesterday. Excellent. Sorry, I'm getting a bit distracted at the moment. Uh, I need to put my watch back on because uh, it's just charged up again. Take the grenade. So I will be back with you in a moment. I just need to do this. I couldn't believe it when uh, I, I was looking at stuff in duty free as we were going on holiday. And I was at. Admiring a, a nice watch and thinking, ah, you know, I've got a bit of uh, cash, I'll, I'll treat myself. Then my mum just bought it and gave it to me, it's like, good me, good grief. So, yeah, <sighs> Radley, London. Same people who made my handbag, which is a bit weird. Uh, apparently they're a, a bag and uh, watch manufacturer. <laughs> Seems like an odd, uh, odd coupling, but okay. So I was very, very happy with that. Thank you very much, Mum. Right, we're going to have a look around. There's not an awful lot here. Let's have a look up the stairs. You could have paid good money for your holiday. There should have been thick accents and spaghetti for pudding. A spaghetti pudding? That would be interesting. How would that work? Would it be like crepes? Like thin crepes. What's in here? Ooh. <laughs> Okay, there's a lot of weird stuff in here, but we have found a treasure chest. Open says me! Received pile bunker. Now, I don't know about you, but I don't want a bunker for my piles, you know? Received master fist! Oh. <laughs> I don't know what either of these are, but I'm very, very interested. <laughs> <laughs> I could make an awful lot of pile banger. Oh, it's not bunker banger. It's not as good as Max Ray. Okay. So what's Master Fist? Is that for Nox? Master Fist? Yes. Okay. God's Hand it has uh, only four slots. Crystal Glove has six. 
Master Fist is not as good as either of them. So I'm going to go with not using any to see what that... So Motor Drive only has three, but its growth is double. Right. We need the Crystal Glove then, don't we? We definitely need the Crystal Glove. Rather than that. Power of Land Condition. Master Fist. Easy now. I know. It's such a... Well, clearly... God's hand is going to be the one we use because, uh, yeah. Increase the rate of preemptive attacks and we can add in. Well, we've got an awful lot of stuff here, haven't we? So we might as well go with the, the destruct one that has death as a potential spell. <laughs> there we go. Right, let's go. So we got some nice stuff. Hey, where's Patrick? I don't know. I haven't spoken to him all day. <coughs> I hope he's alright. What's this over here? Looks like someone's dropped a, a bike on a on a trampoline. I don't know. Let's go in. We're going up. Oh. Oh, that was weird. That was a weird effect. If this was a modern game, I'd say it was hiding a loading screen, but I know that here it's just doing it because it can. Because <laughs> everything's a loading screen. Right, where are we? There are more lifts, so what's around? Ba -ba 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 -ba. It's the Horde! By the way, if you, anyone's uh, not watched the Masters of the Universe, the latest uh, one there yet on Netflix, pretty damn good. I enjoyed it. Watched the entire thing in one day. Thoroughly enjoyed it. <laughs> and would recommend it. Much better than the first season. Even though the first season I enjoyed, it's actually got He-Man in it this time, which is nice. <laughs> Since... <laughs> I'm sorry, guys, but anyone who claims, oh, it's Master of the Universe, it was never about He-Man. It was always about He-Man. That was the point. Am I just going back down the stairs for nothing? I'm hoping to find something. Hi, Lex. How you doing? You had a good set of games that you picked up there, Lex. And thank you for pointing out that... Uh... Oh, that's at the bottom. <laughs> thank you for pointing out that... Uh... Uh, the PSP got uh, X-Men Legends. I will be picking up a copy of that. I have it on PlayStation, but it feels like the kind of game that I'd play while I'm in bed while trying to, when I can't fall asleep. <coughs> <coughs> Which is the way I've been playing on Untold Legends, to be honest with you. So, that could be my fun game next, but I'm going to track it down. Right, there's nothing here. There are two things here, bugger and all. <laughs> and all just left. Right, let's see if we can go back to where we were. Unless I should have gone through the other lift. I should have gone through the other lift, shouldn't I? Oh well, it's done now. They do like bobbing this uh, lift sequence around, don't they? interesting effect. I kind of like it, you know? Right, we're back. Where the hell are we? This isn't where I was. Oh, it is where I was. I'll... Only it's not quite. It's like, yeah. X-Men Legends 2 is your personal favourite. Nice. I will be looking uh, out for a copy. <coughs> I actually don't know what I'm doing here, apart from wandering around and seeing whether we can find stuff. <coughs> Sorry, I am still full of gunk. I'm hoping to get through an entire night of the show tonight, but uh, if I start coughing a lot, you'll know why. Well, I keep coughing a lot, that's what I'm actually meant. <laughs> Uh, 
Let's do this. <laughs> Just take a grenade. Yeah, we'll, we'll have a grenade. Thanks. That's great. That <laughs> give it, just give some like, high explosive to a bunch of freaking teenagers. That's fine. Teenage environmental terrorists. Because <laughs> that's what they are. We shouldn't forget uh, that uh, these people trying to save the world did attempt to blow up a reactor at the start of the game. <laughs> We're playing a bunch of bastards. Oh dear, now I'm here for it. Right, we're back here, so obviously it was the wrong decision to go back down. <coughs> right, let's go in here. I hope these doors don't go to different places, you know. It'd be very annoying if they do. Ah, I remember this from that point where we were fighting that giant tank. Right, we're going to floor 65. We can't go to 69. Don't have a car key. Right, we've got to 65. <laughs> <coughs> right. Let's have a look around in here. See what we find. Is this the meeting room table? Is that where all the people would... would no, that's... Oh! This is Thingy! Yeah, I remember what this is. This is from earlier. We had a cutscene in here. That gap is where we blow up the reactor. <laughs> because we're not the good guys. Well, we are. We're the slightly less bad guys, I suppose. It's not quite the same, but we'll go with it. <clears throat> it's not the best uh, thing. You know? Right. You're happy that your wife downloaded Transformers War and Fall of Cybertron and Dynasty Warriors Gundam Reborn. With all the DLC. Nice. <coughs> yeah, War for Cybertron. I need to... Oh, we've been here already to get all these things. Look, all, all the treasure chests are open. We didn't need to come here. Ah, we did. Because there's a way up. Is this basically our chance to pick up any crap that we haven't picked up before? Is that what's going on here? Because it does feel like that's what's going on here. Can I not get out? Let me out! I don't know where that voice came from. <laughs> okay, are we here? Floor 67 won't let us out. Why have we not got the key card, by the way? I'm sure we had one earlier. Is the area with all the blood from earlier on. Yeah, this is just an area to pick up or to have a, a, a quick check. Right, this is... Yeah, okay. So we've got the bits that we needed, basically. So now we're going back out because there's no other reason to be here. We can't exit these uh, doors. <coughs> Are we still looking for Genoma? To be honest with you, I don't know what we're looking for at this point. Aside from a, a reason to continue living. <laughs> what am I talking about? Hey, we got out! Okay, let's have a look around here and see what happens. Can we get in? Is there any nice... Vendor machine, give me some sweets. Go on, you know you want to. Oh, I want some fruit pastels. Which, by the way, in Italy are not called fruit pastels. They're called fruit juicy, and it's exactly the same bloody thing. And it's still in English. <laughs> Let's get some rest. We found a bedroom. It's ridiculous. They're, they're fruit pastels, but they don't call them fruit pastels. But they still write the name in English. So just leave it as fruit pastels. Seems weird. Right, there's nothing else in here? No. But can I use... The uh, lift to get somewhere else. No. Yes. Go on, let me in, let me in. Won't let me up there. This smells. This smells of bums and farts. Alright, we're going. 
<laughs> Even when we found a way out, we still couldn't... Oh, that's what it's for. Okay, fair enough. Alright. Let's have a quick, uh... Juice up on my, uh... Glass of Coke. Tonight's beverage of choice is the Hokey Cokey. Oh, Hokey Cokey Cokey. Oh, Hokey Cokey Cokey. <laughs> oh, there we go. <coughs> so, we've, uh pretty much run out of uh, things. Let's do this. Let's get out of here and see what's happening. Right, there's an other way. Ooh. Hi, Hillside Junction. How you doing? One-handed game playing while I had a drink there. Hey! <laughs> I do like a game that can play one-handed. Right, we're going in here just to see what happens. And then we'll make our way back to where we were supposed to be. Ooh. What's this? A dingy cyberpunk alley? All that's missing is rain and some guy called Decker. Where are we? Is this just the stairs that I was on before? Because this looks an awful lot like the stairs I was on before. Let's see if there's anything nice in them. Probably isn't. Pretty sure. <clears throat> Give me a second, guys. Oh, wave of sickness. I hate this illness. Whatever the hell I've got, I hate it. I'll be, I'll be back. Amazingly, this isn't even the first time I've had to rush off stream because I thought I was going to be sick. <laughs> what is my life? Sorry about that, guys. 
Oh my goodness, sorry about that. Let's do this. We've got some butts to kick. And it looks like we have now dealt with all of the stuff that's in this area. So we get to go back to the main game. By climbing all the way down the stairs. I'm getting flashbacks to Ghostbusters on the NES. At least we didn't have to bring along any ghost bait. Which, by the way, is an absolute scam. Because, yeah, it attracts the ghosts. And then once you cl uh, climb up more stairs and the screen scrolls, the ghosts come back because they're not being attracted by the bait because it's not on screen anymore. That was ridiculous. Am I okay? Yeah, sorry, just a wave of sickness came over me. I had to rush off. I'm sorry about that, guys. I didn't mean to scare anyone. It's just... How, how am I this far up the... Did I climb two... Oh, good grief. I think we're stuck in a loop. A perpetual loop of suck. Hang on. Received Behemoth Horn. Okay, it was worth us coming in here. Right, okay, let's do this. Let's get out of here. <coughs> 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 I'm just not... I, I picked up an illness. For those of you who weren't here last night, I picked up an illness on the way home from holidays because I was stuck in a in a, ch a flying tube of recycled farts and germs, also known as an aircraft. <coughs> <coughs> and I have an autoimmune disorder, so naturally if something's around, I'm going to catch it. Oh, dear. The holiday was worth it, though. The holiday of an absolute lifetime. I will eventually stop. Why am I constantly going downwards? The only Ghostbusters game you like is the one that came on on PS3 and Xbox 360. Yeah, the... Uh, where is it? It came out on... Um, PlayStation 2 as well. Didn't it? I'm sure I have it. Don't I have it? I'm sure I've got it. Yes. It came on PS2. Hi, Colin. How you doing? Ghostbusters, the video game. On uh, PS2. Yeah. The most annoying part of uh, that game, though, is that they cartoonified the graphics for the PS2 and Wii versions. It's the same game, but they cartoonified the graphics because of the, the lower processing power of the older consoles compared to 360 and PS3. So, of course, they did. But they never thought, hey, why don't we give them the, the outfits and design of the real Ghostbusters? Since we're cartoonifying everything. And I would have bought it twice if that had been the case. I'd have had the 360 version and I'd have had the PS2 version. I'd have loved that. <laughs> you had the PC version, very realistic, nice. What I'd love is to play the uh, one on uh, Quest 3. Unfortunately, I have an Oculus Quest 2. Uh, so I can't play it from what I can tell. How do I get out of this damn place? It feels an awful lot like I'm just going around the frickin' circle here. Have I broken the game? Have I got lost in an, uh, an impenetrable tomb of suckingness? I want to get out of here and go back to the game. Yet, yeah, But uh, yeah, the Quest 3 has a virtual reality Ghostbusters game. And I so want to play it. But I don't have a Quest 3, I have a Quest 2. So I don't think it works. I've played the... The seventh guest on uh, P on the Oculus Quest 2, though. Wow, that game is amazing, by the way. If you get a chance on a virtual reality system, go for it. Right. I am seeing the same thing at the top of these stairs every single time. I think we're stuck in a loop. <coughs> I genuinely think I'm stuck in a loop. How am I supposed to get out of here? This was not worth getting the horn. Hey, hey. But no. 
this was not worth it to get that uh, special hot. If I get to the top and there's a, a computer on the second uh, floor, I think we're going on a loop. There is not a computer on the second floor. We aren't going in a loop. Okay. <coughs> But yeah, if you get the chance to play the seventh guest VR, I recommend it on Oculus Quest, but uh, I think it's out on other things. Then I recommend you take it because it's a hell of a game. There's the exit! <laughs> All this going up and down stairs give you flashbacks to Metal Gear Solid. <laughs> oh my goodness. <clears throat> it's amazing how many of us have those memories of games, isn't it? Also, we appear to be going across a uh, floor sponsored by Tetris, because there's the uh, lefty and righty uh, L-shaped ones. And uh, the T-block is here as well. Here, there's the T-block. And that's the T-block. <laughs> this, this flooring is sponsored by Tetris. <laughs> Right, I don't ever want to have to do that again, so I'm going to save the game again. Save find access the menu and select save to save your game! Ugh, <coughs> 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 oh, I hate being ill. Right, we'll save that one again. Saving, do not remove memory card. So, of course, once we finish this game, we do have, uh, or Grand Theft Auto 3, depending on which happens first, we do have Valhalla to play. And after that, we'll be playing Fable, which would be cool. And then I think we've got some others as well to play, but I can't remember what they were, because I forgot to write them down. <laughs> I'm not sure this was worth getting the horn. Chantelle O'Clap, 22 year old, single mother of six. <laughs> Iron Horse, my goodness! Accurate, but, uh, hmm. Hmm. There we go, right. I love the music in this freaking game, it's brilliant. <coughs> And also, can we can we take a second to appreciate the uh, storytelling of the camera angles? Look at the size of our guy compared to this building. It dominates. There's no reason for a game to make the character tiny on screen, except to show the sheer size and power of the company that we're going up against. It's visual storytelling, and it's amazing. <coughs> I really appreciate stuff like that. I, I love it. Right, here we go. We're going in. Right, let's go. I'm assuming that at some point it's going to tell us we're going the wrong way. Yep, dead end. Haha. <laughs> Emotional damage. <laughs> Have you been watching Stephen He as well? <laughs> I love the Stephen He channel. He's hilarious. <coughs> I can't do his uh, voice though. Emotional damn it. I can't do it. Wish I could, but I can't. Right, double cut, go for it. And then magic, that's uh, just lightning bolts. A whole lot of them, get it over with. I love that they use lightning on, on cloud and it doesn't work because it's like, haha, <laughs> I am immune to your lightning powers. None of our people are getting hurt. That's amazing. One of them was supposed to have cast a spell and they haven't. That's a bit... <coughs> bit annoying, but here we go. Can we, can we finish the fight by actually, you know, 
doing something here, please. Why are my characters not using their powers? I've asked two of them to cast a frickin' spell at this point, and no one's doing it! Has the game broken? Oh no, finally we're getting there. Lex has just sent me a, a link, which is cool. I'll have a look at that later, thank you very much. There we go. Turbo ether. When you need ether. And fast. <laughs> oh, I'm going to sit back in that chair for a bit now. Rest my neck. <coughs> okay, so we go back down here, and then we turn and go left so that we can continue the game. I believe that is the correct move. Yes. We're back to section 8. We go across here and up. Right, where are we going? Again, look at the size of our character on screen. Giving us an idea of the sheer scale of this place. Ooh! What the hell is that? This can't be. Oh! <gasps> Oh my goodness, what the? What is that? <laughs> Here they come! <laughs> so they really showed up. Oh, there's two of them, is there? No? Yes. Oh, this is amazing. Oh, I love it. You sure did treat us like dogs up to now. You killed off a lot of my precious soldiers. <laughs> yeah, but let's see how you do against anti-weapon artillery. You guys are worthless, but my proud creation is a sure thing. <laughs> oh my, this is, this game is brilliant. Look at the sheer scale of that frickin' thing. Hello, Space Chicken, how you doing? The mighty Space Chicken has arrived. Uh, I'll show you the destructive power of the prod clot. <gasps> what? <laughs> what kind of name is that? The proud clot. <laughs> a clod, for those of you who aren't so well versed in 1950s slang from the Beano, is a very stupid person. <laughs> right, here we go. Bolt three. Bolt three and... Bolt three. <laughs> This thing's got four arms, by the way. It's four armed. Not doing much in terms of damage. <coughs> Bumface's limit break is not being set off. Knee blend. What the frick? Right, I think we need a summon. Let's summon the water damage on this electric robot. See what happens. Now to steal. Okay. Hookily dookily. Double cut on that as well. <coughs> Prod Claude engage! <laughs> it is. Here we go. Look, wow. We've made a summon. We've summoned Leviathan, a giant snake. And it's smaller than this robot. Now that is excellent visual storytelling. That is fantastic. The sheer scale of this thing. I think what we need now is to summon the frickin' Power Rangers. <laughs> and ask them to, to form Dinosaur or whatever it was. The Megazord, that was it. Man, 
Go, go, Power Rangers! Wingman had an operation on his toe today. Oh my goodness. I hope he's recovering okay. You love the summons of Final Fantasy VIII. I have not played much of Final Fantasy VIII. Um, I loaded it up to make sure it worked, and it did, and that was it. <laughs> <coughs> Go on. My summons are doing nothing to this freaking robot. Okay, that's uh, Bolt 3 in it again. Bomb face, do a double cut. Oh my goodness. This thing is hardly getting hurt. But then again, it's hardly hurting us, so it's kind of equal. In a battle of attrition, I think we're going to win in the end. <coughs> Through sheer weight of people. I love that I love that it's got this real bam 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 visceral sound to it and then it doesn't do a freaking thing. Right, we need uh Behemoth Zero. Come on, flying Godzilla monster, come and help us. Can I summon death on this thing? Is it gonna do you think it'll work? Tosspot's limit break is coming. Good night, boom! Here we go. Right, we're summoning in flying metal Godzilla monster. They've got a power and a force that you've never seen before. Yeah! They've got the ability to morph and to even up the score. That's not the right thing, is it? <laughs> Come on, flying monster. Shoot your laser beams, come on flying monster. He's okay now, is it gone to Oh Ooh, yeah, I can imagine that's not good. Ooh. Well hopefully he'll snail uh, recover very quickly. <coughs> you helped back the new Power Rangers comic that the original Pink Ranger herself had written for. It's called Mad Mighty Morphin Power Rangers The Return. Nice. I have to admit, I haven't read the comics. I've seen the first two seasons and then I moved on. I should go back and watch the rest because I kind of liked it. It was it was like a Godzilla film with a pantomime attached and I kind of liked it. It was just something that was on the background while I was reviewing games uh, or at least uh, dealing with uh, getting the footage to review games. Do -do -do -do. Like when I've been uh, doing some RuneScape, I've been watching uh, YouTube videos on my little uh, screen that I've got here. I've got a little echo show and it's, it's really nice. I mean, it's listening to me all the time, which is not great, but uh, it's nice. <laughs> it's a nice little machine. It's got all oh, my holiday snaps on it as well, so it's it's fun. It lets me uh, <coughs> multitask essentially, keeps me interested in games that I'm otherwise not interested in, so that I've got enough uh, through them to be able to review them. This monster has taken a frickin' age. The people in it must be in quite a state. Because I've lightning bolted them, I've set it on fire. Uh, the giant snake, it flooded it. That it must smell in there now. <laughs> oh, oh, we must have damaged it enough that's doing a major attack. Oh, okay, here we go. I love the way things keep changing in this game. You, know, you never know what's coming next. Come on, let's see. <coughs> It's gonna it's charging its laser. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm so sorry. Lex says he wants cosplay as the Black Ranger. Cool. Go for it. Come on, do it, yeah. We're getting nowhere with this, are we? It's <laughs> nothing's getting through. Maybe I should try physical attacks. 
What? Fire was born. What the frick is a Ragnarok? Did I just win? Huh. Not that. This is the proud clod. I think we just won. <laughs> Whoa! Dude! <laughs> Apparently we won. Okay. Let's go. Can't go that way. Okay. Well, okay, that was interesting, certainly. I didn't get to use an Omni Slash on the giant monster. I really wanted to use Omni Slash, but Cloud just wasn't getting hurt. Sorry, not Cloud. Bumface. Bumface wasn't getting hurt. Oh, they are! They they have treasure chests. I thought they were scenery. Received Mistyle, no idea what that is. Received Elixir, I know what that is. And it's very useful, yes I did. They point outside the menu and select save to save your game. Right. Uh we're going to use a tent. There we go. We've got 99 tents. Da -da 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 -da. There we go. And save. Wingman like Power Rangers Turbo. <coughs> That's the second uh, iteration of the Power Rangers, isn't it? Turbo's the one with the cars uh, that comes after the dinosaurs. I know that because of Turbo, a Power Rangers movie. <laughs> We're 50 hours in, guys. 50 frickin' hours. Oh my goodness. We could have watched the Lord of the Rings extended cut twice now. I think if you watch uh, all of Star Trek, it takes about 50 hours. No. That can't be right. Because like 45 minutes each. 500 hours, I think, for Star Trek. Right, magic. Uh, we're fighting a tank, but we just fought a giant robot, so I don't see this being a problem. Remember that time we accidentally died to a penguin, and now we just fought an entire giant robot? <laughs> what the hell?! This... <laughs> okay. We're fighting the tank again because the top fell off. That's actually quite cool story time. I like that. Yes, we got it. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> I love this game. It's so fun. Dolphin blow. <laughs> what the frick is a dolphin blow? Eight inch cannon. What is going on? What the frick is a dolphin blow? Can I hold it? No? No? What the hell is a dolphin blow? <laughs> I've got to find out. <laughs> what is going on in this freaking game? Alright, let's have a look. Shinra Beta is a bracelet of some kind? Frick is a dolphin blow. Catastrophe is a limit skill. For who? Damn, my head hurts. So it's for him. Yeah, it's for him. Okay. <laughs> that was Final Fantasy VI where you suplex a train. Oh my goodness, I need that. Eight inch cannon and a dolphin blow. Game hammer after the. I know it feels like that, doesn't it? Final heaven, limit skill. Too sure, but got nothing to do with me. I don't really care. Okay, okay, okay. Battle Trump. I love a battle trump. Um, where is this thing? Why have we still got these magic and magic? Raise his magic power. Give it to him. Raise his spirit. Give it to him. Micro laser, we don't need a micro laser, we want a mega laser. Right, here we go. Explosive damage against one opponent. Oh, so it's an item. Where's dolphin blow? 
Ragnarok is a sword. Okay, that's cool. Uh, I don't see the dolphin blow. Hey, I host an After Dark podcast. <laughs> Game Hammer After Dark is basically a joke like, when things get a bit rude, you know? <laughs> Where's dolphin blow? I want <laughs> to see what dolphin blow is. Is it a key item? No. So what the hell is it? I, I don't know. We'll look it up in a minute. Uh, equip bump, not Norks. Equip bump face. Is Ragnarok a good sword for us to be using? Yes. Yes it is. So, it gives us the same number of things, but they're linked. And it gives us more stuff. Okay. Hi Martin, how you doing? There we go. So Ragnarok's still the same. It's fine. We've mastered Shiva. Master of Shiva. We don't really use Shiva though. Much. Increases rate of preemptive attacks. We don't actually use Shiva much, but we'll keep it there. Right, there we go. Right. So we've now got a more powerful sword for him to use called frickin' Ragnarok, because of course it is. Uh, I still don't know what Dolphin Blow is for. <laughs> I'm assuming it's some kind of item. It's just like, what the hell is going on in this freaking game? We fought a tank that fell in half and we still had to fight the other half. A giant robot turned up and it was crap. And now we got freaking Dolphin Blow. This game is insane and I'm here for it. Right, can we go around here? There's a bench in the way and then an invisible wall of doom. But we can go around the back. Can we get further? Yes! Yes, we can. I can run behind this sign and it does nothing. Right, okay. <coughs> right. After this fight, I'm... Oh, I'm going to fight the tank again. I'm going to find out what Dolphin Blow is by looking it up on the wiki. Right, here we go. Hang on. Bolt 3. Says it's got... F There's four bits to this tank? I can attack four bits of it? Cloud's almost dead. Bumface, sorry. is almost dead. What's going on? At least this limit break is building up because we get to use Omni Slash again. Hey! <coughs> Eight-inch cannon, yay! I bet the 8-inch cannon's only like 4 inches. <laughs> I'm sorry guys, welcome to Game Hammer After Dark. <laughs> Don't Google it. Oh my God. <laughs> Dolphin Blow is Tifa's third limit break. Ah. That makes more sense. Okay, so, um, item, where's Dolphin Blow? So we need to use it then, don't we? We need to give it to us. It should be possible for it to be highlighted. Where is it? Like, seriously, high wind? What's that? <clears throat> Learn limit skill high wind. Got the wrong person. Nothing to do with me. Okay. Where is it then? There's heaven. Uh, the thing we're using. Eight inch cannon. It's not there. We we got a re we got it. We picked it up, and now it's not here. I don't get it. Can't already have it, surely. Oh, level three dolphin. Bl right, okay, I get what's going on now. Right, we're still on limit level two, though. I think we need to leave that for the moment, don't we? How long have I been veggie since 1996? Coincidentally, that is the same year that I last went to away on holiday. This way, bum face. Do, 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 do. 
パパパパパパパンパンパンパパパパパパン<笑> Here we go、right. Magic and Bolt Threes Magic and Bolt Threes、uh, Bomb face double cut with a new sword Let's see how good it is High wind Isn't that what you get when you need too many beans? <laughs> Yes. Yes, it is. Can confirm. Okay. It's not bad, but it's not even hitting 2,000 hit points yet for damage. <laughs> We've been going for over an hour already. Wow, tonight is flying by. Let's do this. Let's kick some butts. Ah, he is Edgelord. Damn. Crucial. Okay. Is that all he's going to say? Yeah, that's all he's going to say. There's something glittering on these stairs. We need it. Ladies and gentlemen, we need to find out what that is. What's it? Ooh. A two headed grip. A three headed grip. Oh, I like this. Cast death on it. Let's see what happens. <laughs> uh, bolt three on it. Uh, double cut. Let's get in there. <coughs> this seems to be some kind of chimera. It's uh, off the sausage that long. Oh my goodness, Martin. <laughs> Come on, death. Do your thing. It did nothing. Guys, <laughs> did nothing at all. Right, that's gone. There we go. Death did not. I wasted magic because it did fuck all. Bum face, level up. Diddly dee. Hey, we've, we've leveled two people up tonight. That's nice. Right, what's this on the stairs? Jump your thumb up its arse. <laughs> ah. Yeah, this is received missing score. This is great. Hold on, Hojo. Okay. <coughs> well, he seemed to like that. So, Tossbot, what is this? Missing score is. Oh. Missing score is better than Max Ray. Let's do it. Right, so we've got some extra things to play with now. So let's have an HP absorb. Attacks with paired materia, absorbs HP at the same time. So we'll have an HP absorb. And. What have we got? Not a lot. In fact, we've got Bottle. Ah, here's better ones. Right, what have we got? Destruct. Store. Lightning. Uh, heal. Ooh. Do, 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 do. I'm going to put Bam up with it. So when we try. That should be interesting. Absorbs hit points while using Bayamut. That, that'd be interesting. Right, we're here. Oh, no, there's another thing on here. Pick it up. What's in here? This game is just giving me things. Oh, it's not giving me things. That's not a treasure chest. That was a light. <laughs> it looked like a treasure chest. <coughs> but it wasn't. Hello. Who's this? Hello. Can I talk to you? Here we go. How you? No, no, no. no. Not bad price. Why are you starting all those fires? Hoyo, stop right there. Oh, the failure. At least remember my name. It's Bumface. <laughs> At least remember my name. It's Bumface. I love it. T thanks for coming along, Lex. Have a great night and uh, take care. Yep, you sent me a message. I got the message. It turned up on my watch. Uh, 
Thank you. Take care. Have a great night. Every time I see you, I... <sighs> it pains me that I had so little scientific sense. Zoe, wait. Okay. I evaluated you as a failed project, but you are the only one that succeeded as a Sephiroth clone. <laughs> I'm even beginning to hate myself! None of that matters. Sorry, <clears throat> I'm getting the wrong accent again. No man place, why are you fighting, starting all those fires? We have to do it in a Welsh voice. None of that matters. Just stop this nonsense. Nonsense? Oh, this. We needed to full heal before this fight. Just attack his head, not his guardians. Focus on that. Fair enough. Oh, this. <laughs> I love a proper, proper laugh. Severoth seems to be counting on the energy, so I am going to lend him a hand. Why? Why do that? Quit asking me why, you moron! <clears throat> that voice is hard to do. Actually, you might be cut out to be a scientist. It's a bit late for that now. Energy level is at... 83%? It's taking too long! <clears throat> My son is in need of power and help. That's the only reason. Your son? <laughs> Although he doesn't know. <laughs> what will Severov think when he finds out I'm his father? Always looking down on me like that. Yeah, that's not going to change. You're still a git. <laughs> Sephiroth is your son. <laughs> I offered the woman with my child to Professor Gast's Genova project. When Sephiroth was still in the womb, we took the cells of Genova. <laughs> I can't believe you're the one who did this. The illusionary crime against Sephiroth. Zoe, you need to make an audio story with these voice characters. <laughs> I would love to. <laughs> no. You're wrong. It is my desire as a scientist. <laughs> I was defeated by my desire to become a scientist. <clears throat> I lost the last time as well. What last time? Martin Vegas says, uh, remember Linda McCartney sausages? How can I forget? Linda McCartney sausages. Cardboard is better. <laughs> I've injected Genova cells into my own body. <laughs> oh, is that why you're frickin' nuts? Here are... <laughs> My results! Okay. Oh, hear the, the music. Oh, that is brilliant. Whoa! <coughs> <coughs> <laughs> magic. Fire. Hojo. Oh, Double cut. Hojo. Oh, uh, ooh. Death Blow. That's cool. Summon. Summon Behemoth. On. Oh, okay, this is interesting. Hi, Krista, how are you doing? Spicy tomato ones, working. Okay. Yeah, the ones you get these days, though, they taste like freaking cardboard. Nox, summon. Odin. He might be able to help. Here we go. Who did I for? Who did I summon? Bearmut. <coughs> <coughs> ah, big dragon. Hello. We haven't seen you for a while. Bite his head off. Go on. You know you want to. Go on. You know you want to. Here we go. 
Sonic Boom! Hope you're having a good night, Krista. She says, uh, sorry you're late. Never late. Remember, no one is ever late to Game Hammer because we're all stuck in the past. So I just finished work and sorted better than her sisters and um, looking after her kid for the night. She's in hospital. I hope she's okay. I hope she uh, does okay. Here we go. What is this? Odin! Look at all those legs on that horse. There's still not enough. He's only got six. Isn't he supposed to have eight? Or is it six? I can never remember. Oh, look at that! Missed. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> he one hit killed all the other guys, but <laughs> missed on the other one. Thanks, that's brilliant. Capsule? What's capsule? Good grief! Oh, that's okay. He's just brought, he's brought more out because it was freaking Pokemon. Oh, 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 now let's see how the Mako juice is reacting. What? What? What's he done? What the hell? Where's he gone? What the hell's going on here? We're no, we've got a cast regeneration on uh Iron Horse says no way. Nox, limit break. Hit. Hit. Yeah. Hit. Go for it. Beat rush. <laughs> <coughs> Double cut and hectic ho Oh, I love that. Hectic Hojo. You got the one <laughs> knockout, but bosses are immune. Yeah, it's like freaking hell, man. Can't we, can't we have some freaking luck? That would be nice. No, we can't. Bolt three on giant, smelly, weird guy. Made of bombs and farts. Hectic Hojo. I love it. <coughs> Oh, look at that! Oh, it looks like it's in absolute agony. Bits falling off it. <coughs> Restores hit points! Cheating bugger, that's, that's what I do! That's not what you do! Set it on fire. Aim for the head. I thought I was. I genuinely thought I was aiming for the head. Fire through. Set it on fire! Come on! Yes! Nothing to skip. Yeah, I know. And it's oh, look at it! Oh my goodness, it's it's biting its own tail. What's going on? What? What the hell? It's like it's from the thing. What the hell is going on? Where is it? Fools, this is only my fi- no, this wasn't even my final form! What the- This guy is nuts! Set him on fire again! Life form Hojo this time. Okay. Life form Hojo NA. Not applicable? What? What? Silence! Casting silence on a guy with a gun from an arm isn't going to help much, dude. Silence! <coughs> <coughs> Go on, hit him! Hit him! Yes! Bum face has limit break! <laughs> right, there's silence, so they're just going to kick him in the groin instead. Omni slash. Do it! <coughs> Go for the eyes! By the power of Grey Skull! Hit him with it, yes! This is so overpowered! I love it!
Yes! We finished him with Omni Slash! <laughs> Just as Iron Horse types in, please finish him with Omni Slash. And we did! <laughs> Death Blow was born! <laughs> Death Blow levels up! Oh! That was cool. That was so cool. I love it. I love it all. That was fantastic. <laughs> Bum face goes, huh? Yeah, I was going, huh? I can't believe Sephiroth is Hojo's son. <clears throat> anyway, that's the end of the canon. And we just stand there. Okay. That was so cool. I like that. <laughs> Shinra's finished. Mitya's gonna fall in about... Seven more days. That's what grandfather said. No, he's not Scottish, is he? He's he's, he's Geordie. All right, Harry, right, let's do this. Seven more days. That's what my grandfather said. <coughs> Nanaki. You want to see everyone in Cosmo Canyon again? Aye. You want to see Marlene, right? Didn't ask me that. We'll beat Sephiroth. Then if we don't release the, ho the power of Holy in seven days, there won't be a planet left to protect. If we can't beat Sephiroth, it's as good as death for us. Then we... We'll We'll just go a few days sooner than the rest who will die from meteor. Didn't be thinking you're gonna lose before you even fight. No. <laughs> what I meant was... What are we all fighting for? I want us all to understand that. Save the planet, for the future of the planet, sure, that's all fine. But really, is that really how it is? For me, this is a personal feud. I want to beat Sephiroth and settle my past. Saving the planet just happens to be part of that. I've been thinking. I, I think we are all fighting for ourselves for ourselves and that someone something whatever it is that's important to us that's what we're fighting for that's why we're keeping up this battle for the planet battle of the planets was so good hi james how you doing iron horse says i typed that message at the start of the final battle i've got a serious delay with the stream about 50 seconds oh my goodness sorry about that giant horse tellspot says you're right Sounds cool saying it's to save the planet. But I was the only one who blew up that Mako reactor. Look, I'm batting it now. I can see that wasn't the right way to do things. You think? <clears throat> Frickin' hell, man. It's taken you all this time to realise that blowing up a reactor is not a good way of doing things. <coughs> I made a lot of friends and innocent bystanders suffer. Yeah, you did. Frickin' idiot. At first it was revenge against Shinra for attacking my town, but now, nah, here, yeah, I'm fighting for Marlene. For Marlene, for Marlene's future. I, I guess I want to save the planet for Marlene's sake. Go and see her. Make sure you're right and come back. All of you, get off the ship and find your reasons. Find out your reasons for yourselves. I want you to make sure that, that... I want you to make sure. Then I want you to come back. Maybe. In, oh, what was it? I, our gym lads. Uh, 
Maybe none of us will come back. Beach is gonna kill us all anyway. Let's just forget any useless struggling. Arr. I know why I'm fighting. I'm fighting to save the planet and that's that. But besides that, there's something personal too. A very personal memory that I have. What about you all? I want all of you to find that something within yourselves. If you don't find it, then that's okay too. You can't fight without a reason, right? So, I won't hold it against you if you don't come back. Here we go. Now every book is gone. Except her. Hmm. What are you going to do, Nox? <laughs> I forgot we'd named them such ridiculous things. And then it comes up in the middle of pivotal emotional uh, situations. Did you forget? I'm all alone. I don't have anywhere to go. Oh yeah, because we blew up uh, where she lived, didn't we? That that was a bit of a problem. <laughs> no, we didn't. Shinra did, didn't they? <coughs> Everyone's gone. Yeah, we didn't have anywhere or anyone to go home to. You're right. But I'm sure someday they'll come back, don't you think? Hmm, I wonder. Everyone has an irreplaceable something they're holding on to. But this time, our opponent. Here we go. Hmm, but that's all right, even if no one comes back. As long as I'm with you, as long as you're by my side, I won't give up, even if I'm scared. Fear is the mind killer. <laughs> Nox? No matter how close we are, we were far apart before this. But when we were in the life stream, surrounded by all those screams of anguish, I thought I heard your voice. Sniff. <laughs> she just... I don't think we're supposed to say sniff. I think it's like, or, you know, sniffing. Uh, you probably don't remember this, but deep in my heart, I heard you calling my name. Or at least, or at least I thought I did. Yeah, at that time I heard you calling me. You were calling me back from the stream of consciousness in the live stream. After all, I promised that if ever any the big yeah yeah After all, I promised that if anything were to ever happen to you, I would come to help. No, Patrick. No. Yeah, I'm hoping he's okay. Bumface. Do you think the stars can hear us? No. No, they can't. It's a vacuum in space. So no, they can't hear you. It's a very long way away. Why is this character standing there with her eyes closed? Because this is an emotional moment. Bumface, do you think the stars can hear us? Do you think they see how hard we're fighting for them? I don't know, but... Whether they are or not, we still have to do what we think what we can and believe in ourselves. Someday we'll find the answer, right, Nox? That's what I learned from you when I was in the live stream. Yeah, that's right. <coughs> hey, Nox. I uh, there are a lot of things I wanted to talk to you about. Oh, Is this an emotional moment? Einhorst <laughs> says, Incoming naughty time! <laughs> but now that we're together like this, I don't know what I really wanted to say. I guess nothing's changed at all. Kinda makes you want to laugh. Oh, we're not gonna get the laughing scene from Final Fantasy X, are we? <laughs> Ha 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 ha! That was...
was a weird, a weird point. <laughs> Bum face. Words aren't the only thing that tell people what you're thinking. That's true, you could also have a sign around your neck. I love the way her hair keeps clipping through her head. Bum face sees nothing. <coughs> okay, fade to black. Wow, wow. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, snorkel time. Ah, it's been overnight. It's almost dawn. Huh? Sorry, did I wake you? It's almost dawn, Nox. Um, good morning, bumface. <laughs> Give me a little longer. Just a little bit longer. <laughs> she goes back to... <laughs> I know we're saving the, the universe here, but uh, could I just have another half an hour of snooze? <laughs> this day will never come again, so let me have this moment. Yeah, okay. Brown chicken, brown cow. Ha <laughs> ha, love it. <laughs> Yeah, okay. You just chuck a bone at cacti. Oh my god, that's... <laughs> Guys, welcome to Game Hammer After Dark. Yeah, okay. <laughs> this is probably the last time we'll have together. He's planning to die, isn't he? He thinks they're all going to die. That's 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 great uh, leadership there, Bumface. Fantastic. Make everyone think they're not coming home. <clears throat> Ah, the Helicarrier from <laughs> the Adventures. So, it's daylight now. Iron Horse! <laughs> what? No! That's not how it is! <gasps> no! <laughs> Did he use 8-inch cannon? <laughs> This is my ultimate break. Yes, the shocker. Yes. Nox says, hmm. We'd better go. <laughs> it's an 8 inch cannon. <laughs> but I still. No, 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 no. It's alright, Nox. You said so yourself yesterday. At least we don't have to go on alone. I didn't do the accent for that one, did I? Yes, that's right. <laughs> okay, let's go. Let's go. Gambatai. Oh, said that wrong. Gambatai! <laughs> let's all do our best. <laughs> let's do this. Cloud wipes himself clean on Oh, <laughs> Iron Horse! The airship is too big for just the two of us. Let's make more of us! <laughs> yeah, it's a little lonely without everyone. Don't worry, they'll be back. For start, it's a three-person uh, party. Don't worry, it'll be okay. <coughs> I'll make a big enough ruckus for all of us. Besides, I'm the pilot. No more flying around casually like before. We won't have time to feel lonely. The well, there's no curtains. Iron Horse. Oh my goodness. Oh. Huh? I think we lowered the tone so much. It's now subterranean. <laughs> it's moving. Ooh. Someone else is back. While they spent the nights falling asleep on the, f on the ground and someone got back onto the ship. Ah, uh, they're all here. The gang's all here. Of course they are. Those spots. Bird eye. Oh, oh, 
It's all okay with you. Nanaki! Why didn't you tell me? Oh, the wrong, wrong accent there, sorry. But you know bird's eye. Hey, Nanaki. If you put in now, you'll never know what they'll say later. What are you watching? Oh ho ho ho! Ho ho ho! Oh my goodness! Oh ho 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 ho! Oh no! You maniacs! You fucked it up! Edge Lord! <laughs> I love the stupid names! When they spent the night f f falling asleep. <laughs> Why such a. Why such a puzzle, look? You don't want me to come? <laughs> I think Bumface did enough of that already last night. <laughs> no, it's just that you're always so cold. I thought you didn't care what was happening. Cool. Hmm. I guess that's just how I am. Sorry. What the hell just happened? Did he fly? <laughs> well, looky here, the Shinra manager's come back. Hello! <laughs> uh, excuse me, but I wanted to come along with the main group, but I couldn't get away. So some people in Midgard took me in. I know I have a stuffed animal body, but I'll work really hard. <laughs> I guess that's everyone. I have visions of them all sat with popcorn watching Cloud Limit go <laughs> Cloud's Limit go off all night. Beat Rush indeed. <laughs> nah, Melody's missing. She ain't gonna show up. At least this time she didn't steal our materia. Guess we gotta be thankful for that. Boing, 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 boing. Hello! I'm a prick! <laughs> How could you say that? <laughs> I came all the way here after being seasick as a dog. I didn't go through all that just to have you guys have the best parts all to yourselves. Welcome back, Melody. Gee, Bumface, that's so nice of you to say that. You sick? <laughs> no, she's disappeared again. How many people in this game can frickin' fly? <laughs> well, whatever. I'm gonna be in my reserved seat in the hall, waiting. There we go. <laughs> Thanks, everyone. We didn't come back for your spiky-headed ass. We came back for Marlene. Guess it's just my... What do you call it? Feelings or something? Yeah. But I ain't got no words now. Although she's not here, she left us a window of opportunity. We can't... We can't let it go on like this. Elfato. She was smiling to the end. We have to do something, or that smile will just freeze like that. Let's all go together. Memories of Elfato. Although she should have returned to the planet by now. Something stopped her, and now she's stuck. Forgot about that. Uh, we've got to let go of El Fato's memory. Has anyone, has anyone here changed their mind? I'm counting on you, Bird's Eye. Yeah, yeah. There are two levers here that have been bugging me for a while now. Let me try them out. Alright. 
So what should we do? Oh, sorry. No. no. All right. So what should I do? No, it's bird's eye, isn't it? All right. So what should I do? You decide, bum face. This, this is our last battle. Our target is in the North Cave. Our enemy is Sephiroth. We're going to see Sephi boy. So let's move out and everyone do their best. Here we go. Okay. Ooh. Holy crap. We could have used those guns earlier on. Oh, it's not guns. It's uh, extra. Okay, our propellers just fell off and we turned it into a jet engine. That's fantastic. We now can't um, hover. That's wonderful. Well done. You've just destroyed our ability to fly around. We're almost to the North Cape. We're on our way, Sephiroth. Man, I'm gonna stick it to him. Final boss incoming. I think we are. Oh, here we go. What is it, Bad Eye? Uh, some incredible force. Losing control. Torture. He's knocked the bloody propellers off, and now we're gonna crash. He's turned the entire ship into a frickin' rocket. Get the hell out of here, Funkies. Did not tell you all to go home. Prepare <laughs> for death and meter hyperinflation. <laughs> yes, sir. This is our home, sir. <laughs> oh, man. Stop trying to act so cool. All right, you jokers. Hold me down with everything you've got. <laughs> oh, ho! Game Hammer After Dark again. <laughs> Hold me down, baby. Geronimo! Here we go, we're going in. If we crash the ship into Sephiroth, will it uh, forego the final boss fight? <laughs> you can now drift the high wind. <laughs> I love it. <gasps> oh, end of disc. Whoa. Okay. Save the game to this point on the memory card. Yes! Yes, please! Select a slot. Slot one. Okay. We're going in slot one. Game hammer out the dark. Oh my god. Wow, how quickly has tonight pa pa passed over? I've just looked at the clock. It's uh, 10 to 10 already. So we're going to save and save. And that should be enough. Oh my goodness, he's doing the Batman crouch on, a, on the top of a, a city, in, of a building in Gotham City and just look out. <laughs> Please insert disc three. <laughs> Maybe time for Zoe to start a swear jar. Might be able to pay for that Italian holiday home. <laughs> Save and end the stream now. We don't have any time to do anything else. Yeah, we've saved. So let's open the thing. We're going for disc three. I want to see what happens. First, save the world. Next, save the game. <laughs> Here we go. Can't believe it. We're actually on disc three. Oh my goodness. First week, we have the side quest. It's our last chance. Fair enough. Oh my goodness. How good was tonight's show, though? We have had some interesting fights there. Yep, it was something. What the hell? <laughs> okay. Dum, dum, dum. Da, 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 dum, dum. Right, so, take care. So, next week we will be going down that. I'm going to put the controller down now. Oh my goodness. Guys. I have had a hell of a night tonight. That was amazing. I really enjoyed that. That was so good. Thoroughly enjoyed that. The boss battles were fantastic. We've had some laughs. It was really dramatic. This has been a hell of an episode. I've really enjoyed that.
And I can't believe it's gone over like an hour and 50 minutes already. Wow. So guys, that's Final Fantasy VII for tonight. We're going to come back next week at the start of Disc 3. And, uh, oh my goodness, what a night. No, we don't. We're going back in and flying off the side quest. <laughs> Fair enough. Well, yeah, if it's our final chance, then let's do that. We'll go and finish the, the last of the side quest, I suppose, at the end, near the end of the game, and then we're going in for the final battle. Oh, my goodness. This has been amazing. I have really enjoyed tonight. I hope you guys have too. Ah, it's good to be back. I know a, a, a break was needed, and I thoroughly enjoyed it, and I had a, a great time, but oh, this has just been amazing. I hope you've all had a great evening too. Guys, I'll see you tomorrow for Dark Souls. We'll finish this, well, not finish it. We'll continue this next Thursday. And uh, on Monday, hopefully, if I'm not unwell, I seem to be getting an awful lot better. Let's put it that way. We'll be doing the rare PS2 games that I was supposed to be doing this Monday, which I didn't do. But until then, thank you so much for joining me. I hope you've had a great evening as much as I have. Take care. Thank you for coming. And... Oh, we need all the ultimate weapons. We need to get everyone to at least level 60. Okay, well, we'll do that. Take care. Have a great evening. Bye for now. Bye. Oh, remember to like, comment, subscribe, all that. You know the drill. It's YouTube. Take care. Bye-bye.